Hello YouTube, this is Godzilla 98 Rules, and today I'm going to show you my first ever Godzilla toy review. And to start off, I'm going to show you my first ever Bandai Godzilla figure. The 6 inch Godzilla 1954 by Bandai Creations. Okay, let's get started. Detail. I hope you can see this, I need a better camera but the detail on this is pretty good it has the scales and bumps and the uh, detail on the tail here it's all good just like the first Godzilla suit and right up here too we have the wrinkles in the skin to make it look like the first Godzilla suit right here and there and the fins as most people know, the fins are not accurate, but that doesn't bother me. They still look good. Okay, and... Okay, hold up. Let me... Okay, and as for the face, it looks very good to me, too, even though it looks a little cartoonish and looks like he's smiling at you. <laughs> I like it. Looks like a very good job there. We have the ears, the eyebrows, nose... All looks okay to me. Okay. Okay, now for the paint job. As most people know, the paint job is very basic. We got uh, overall charcoal gray look like he's supposed to have. He's got white hair on his claws. And to me, the fins, they're white, but I think they're a little too white. But that's just me. And, of course, the eyes look okay. The only thing that most people comment about and complain, but doesn't bother me, is the red tongue. Because he's supposed to be black and white, but to me, it uh, gives you an idea of what he probably looked like in color. But, doesn't bother me a bit. Okay, articulation. Articulation on this figure is very basic. Arms can rotate 360 degrees. The legs can rotate 360 degrees. You have to move the arms out of the way. And the tail can rotate 360 degrees, but since my tail is so stiff, I wouldn't recommend doing it, and I'm not going to do it. Okay, let's try scaling. Let's try... Uh, the uh, six inch guy again from Bandai Creations. Hmm. This looks okay. Even though I think guy again was a little taller, but I think this would work. Basically, if you want to have a fight with this guy, I think it'd work. Okay. Let's try King Ghidorah. Or King Ghidorah, whichever one you want to call him. Back up some. Okay, I think this would work too, even though I think King Adora would probably be about right here, really, but I think this would work. Hmm. Yeah, this looks okay to me. Okay, let's see. Overall, the articulation is good, scaling is okay, paint job could have been a bit better, but doesn't bother me. The uh, detail is very nice. The only, the only thing I'd comment about is the long, skinny arms, but doesn't bother me. Overall, I'll give this figure a 4 out of 5, mainly because... Um, the arms. But anyways, that's my first ever toy review. This is Godzilla 98 Rules signing out.